Well, now to Governor Hutchinson's newsmaking veto of a bill that drew sharp criticism from the transgender community. House Bill 1570 would prohibit Arkansans under 18 from undergoing gender reassignment surgery or even receiving hormone therapies. Channel 7 Shelby Rose at the Capitol tonight with the governor's reasoning. Shelby. Chris, the governor says his decision to hand out this veto was carefully thought of after speaking with representatives on both sides of the issue. To put it simply, House Bill 1570, also called the SAFE Act, would have prohibited doctors from providing gender confirming medications and surgeries to minors, even with the consent of a parent. This is not the only bill surrounding transgender rights in Arkansas, but it is the first the governor has vetoed. He called it well intended, but off course. House Bill 1570 would put the state as the definitive oracle of medical care overriding parents, patients, and health care experts. While in some instances the state must act to protect life, the state should not presume to jump into the middle of every medical, human, and ethical issue. The co-sponsors of the SAFE Act, Representative Robin Lundstrom and Senator Alan Clark, say they are shocked and disappointed at the governor's decision. They reacted to statements made by Hutchinson shortly after his press conference, including his claim that this legislation is a product of a cultural war in America. That this is a cultural war on children. These children need to be protected. These drugs are off label and shouldn't be used on children. When they're adults, they can make those decisions. That this bill was off course. No, this bill is right on target to protect children. That's exactly what we should do. We do that every day by saying, no, you wait till 21 to have alcohol. And Hutchinson did say multiple times that he fully expects the House and the Senate to override this veto, which they only need a simple majority vote to do so. But there's not exactly a timeline of when that could happen. Chris. Okay, we'll keep an eye on that, Shelby. Thank you.